Al here on Good Day Columbia, and we've been talking about indie grits, and right now you're taking a look at a lovely piece of art. I love this piece. I really do, and fortunately, I am here with the artist, and Christian V joins us this morning. Thank you so much for coming down. You're welcome. We appreciate this. My pleasure. Now, Indie Grits has a ton of stuff going on. We are talking food, crafts, technology, of course film. It's a film fest. And art. And art. And uh, they're doing something so cool this year. We're going to talk about open studios. I'm going to give them just a quick rundown of what it is. Right. Basically, on April 21st and 22nd, this is a free event, and you can do your own self-guided driving tour through uh, Richland and Lexington and go see artists in their working private studios. So you get Correct. to go into their space and mm -hmm. you've invited folks to come and see your space. I've done it before and this will be, it's always been rewarding. It uh, gives the, uh, uh, the artist a chance to sell the work because the artist gets 100% of the of the sale price. Uh, he doesn't have to split a commission. And that and means the customer doesn't have to pay the middleman either. And there, That's right and there are 69 artists involved this year and uh, it's uh, it's always a very pleasant experience. Now tell me this, I have a question. Um, what would be the difference, the major difference that stands out for you for a person getting to see you in your private space, the things that inspire you, the space that you've created to work in, as opposed to seeing your work in, say, a gallery? In a gallery, uh, you're, gonna, you're going to get an inflated price because the gallery has to make a commission. Uh, in the artist studio, they're selling it without the middleman, so you get a better price and possibly bargain with the artist. And I have to think there's got to be, you know, something to be said as a as a, a voyeur, a consumer, to go and look and, and you know see a creation like this. And I want to talk about these pieces in just a moment, but see the creation next to the paintbrushes that were used and maybe the window that you look out. You no. know, I just I kind of want to get into your head too while I'm looking at the artwork that you created because I think there would be some insight as to you know some of the pieces that come out right quite often you, uh, the prop will be lying around that was used as a prop within a painting and things like that see yes. i think that's so much cooler than going to a gallery and i love a gallery i do but i think that's so much cooler i think you'll get a much more like in-depth layered experience and you get a one-on-one -on -one with the artist themselves so you get to actually talk to them when they're yes. comfortable in right. the environment right quickly let's talk about this piece right here we only have a few seconds um i love this one it, it a little a little religious intent or, s it or was spiritual? This, this one was done years ago, but it was done for Tiffany and Company <gasps> on Fifth Avenue. Sold. Uh, no, this is the only one that didn't sell. I, 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 it, they wanted to buy it, but I uh, kept it for myself. The others all sold. I did the windows for Tiffany and Company three different times. This is one of the paintings I did on one of those occasions where I did five paintings of this scale. From what I understand, your house is the place to be. If you're going to go to the Artist Studios tour, again, taking place on April 21st and 22nd, make sure you stop by Christian V's studio. I hear your house is very eclectic and has surprises for all the visitors. Thank you, and it's nonprofit. Nonprofit and absolutely free. And the information is on your screen. It goes on from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., and you do get to visit the artists, speak with them in their private studios. Christian, thank you for coming down and sharing your work this morning. My pleasure, Alexis. We'll be back with more Good Day right after this.